to our Mad Lips video. We're going to be yeah. doing Gobble Gobble again. Gobble Gobble, because it's almost Thanksgiving. All right. Three days. Three hey, yo. Mad Let's get started. <laughs> so today, we're actually going to record the process of making the Mad Libs. Um, most people probably already know how this works, but in case you don't, you have this sheet, and it's like a story, but there are certain parts that are blank, and it says, like, part of the body, so you fill in that one with a part of the body, and this yeah, one has a number, a type of liquid, blah, blah, blah. Once they're all filled in, then you just read the story, and it's always hilarious. All right. Literally always. Literally always. Okay, so... First up, we have W's egg. What? We need a part of the body. Uh, nose. Nose. Glitter girl, we need a number. Hmm. 45,000. Whoa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 45,000. Nose. Um, w Zeg, nobody can see you up there. I don't care. All we see is legs and a butt. <laughs> <laughs> and feet. <laughs> Face. <laughs> the floor. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> w Zeg, we need a type of liquid, please. Um, diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. All right. Um,. <clears throat> <clears throat> Glitter girl, plural noun, please. Hmm. Books. Books. <laughs> oh. Glitter. Hey. Okay, plural noun, please. Turn on the sounds. People. People. Ooh, that's a good one. Good job, glitter. Okay, W Zeg. Can you tell me a part of the body? Um but <laughs> cricket sounds for those parts. Because he's like um Okay. Um, <laughs> Glitter girl. What? Plural noun, please. Mm -hmm. Butt cheeks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Butt cheeks. <laughs> That's funny. Um, impressed turtle. Impressed turtle. <laughs> you who? <laughs> okay. Um, we need a noun, please. Um. Well, um. Grenade. Sounds. grenade. Ooh, grenade. That's unique. Good job, impressed turtle. Goodbye. Glitter. A noun, please. Um, the, um, poof balls. Poof ball. Poof ball. Oh, look! Here comes our next participant. <laughs> Rat cat, cat. He's not a participant. I'm gonna, at all. I'm gonna get a participant. Uh, I found the participant. <laughs> Sylvester, I would like you to tell me a noun, please. Kid, cricket sounds. Cricket? Is that the noun that you want to use? No. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Rat -a -tat -fat, Rat -a fat cat. All right. He's too fat. rat a -tat fat cat Can what? you please tell us a part of the body? Um. Um. Uh, chew. Uh, chew. Uh, um. Whiskers. Ooh, whisker. Okay. Good a girl. I need an adverb. Hmm. What does that mean again? Well, according to this book, an adverb, it tells how something is done. Oh, yeah. It modifies a verb and usually ends in L-Y. Modestly, stupidly, greedily, and carefully are all adverbs.
Greedily. All right, we can use that greedily. Okay, type of liquid, W Zig. Water. Ooh, water. Hey. Glitter girl. What? I need another adverb. Um. Hey. <laughs> Quickly. W Zig. Pickle. A number. Two thousand eight hundred and fifty. Glitter girl, part of the body. Um. <laughs> um. One hour later. Um. <laughs> um. The, um. Okay, lungs. don't shoot baby boo, whatever. Lungs. Lungs. Yeah. Okay. W zeg. We need an adjective, which is a describing word. Take them from me. Fat. All yeah, right. Me. And just like that, we are done. So, the title of this Mad Libs is How to Roast a Turkey. Mm. To roast a turkey. You first have to remove the turkey's neck, heart, gizzard, and nose. Then preheat the oven to 45,000 degrees. <laughs> Wash out the turkey with diarrhea. <laughs> and then fill it with stuffing. Popular stuffing ingredients include cubed books, oh, celery, okay. raisins, onions, <laughs> and... <laughs> Close up the turkey cavity using string or metal butt cheeks. Rub melted grenade or poof ball oil all over the outside of the turkey and then sprinkle it greedily with salt and pepper. Place the whole thing, whiskers down, in a pan and add several sprigs of fresh light. Put it in the oven with a tray beneath it to catch any water that might drip from the turkey's butt. Every half hour, stick a thermometer into the turkey's lungs <laughs> to make sure it doesn't rise above 2,850 degrees. The turkey is done when its juices appear fat. Take the turkey out of the oven, carve quickly, and enjoy. We're back. We're back with more Mad Libs. We just got yeah. finished making our Mad Libs again. Yes. Yeah. So this one is again from the Gobble Gobble Mad Libs book. Whoa, look at this dust. Okay. And it is entitled The First Thanksgiving. In late 1620, Starting over, in late 1620, 500 pilgrims arrived at Plymouth Rock. No. They had come all the way from Knott's Berry Farm to find <laughs> religious freedom in America. But life in the new poop flakes was not easy. Their first winter was clear, and many fat boys fell ill. Luckily, the following year, a weird Native American named Dadik taught the pilgrims how to grow crops like corn and amusement parks. Wow, that was nice of him. By that November, the pilgrims had plenty of cats to harvest, so they decided to have a stinky feast. They invited their pretty Native American friends to join them, and the festival lasted for 55 days. They ate the caterpillars of their harvest as well as deer and several skinny birds. It was a piggy to remember and has since become known as the first Thanksgiving. While the menu has changed crazily over the years, Thanksgiving is still a time to celebrate our butt cracks and our morbidly <laughs> obese future. I mean fortune. Our morbidly obese Hi. fortune. Oh, hello, Blacka. <laughs> oh, so in case you guys were wondering, this is Grandma Blacka. She's the one who makes the famous <laughs> Donald Trump pie. <laughs> <laughs> 
She's not actually grandma. She doesn't have kids. No, that's true. She got fixed. She yeah. will never be a grandma. Ever. Ever. <gasps> oh. So Poor sad. baby. Poor blue girl. <laughs> All right. That's it for tonight. No, it's not. Yes, oh. it is. Oh, it's oh, and um, currently 9.41, and very, you guys should be in bed. A very beautiful cat to say bye. <gasps> so fast! <laughs> <laughs> say bye, so fast.